Hey, Fighting Illini fans, Michelle Provenzano here at Huff Hall, where I'm catching up with volleyball head coach Kevin Hamley. Coach, the Illini and you are back from a weekend of competing at Indiana and Purdue. You had a three-set win at Indiana and a three-to-two loss at Purdue. Just talk about what it was like to play those teams over the weekend. Well, I thought we made an improvement on the defensive end. That's something we've been talking about. And um, I thought against Indiana, we did a nice job. We had a really nice comeback in the first set. Uh, you know, I had to make some changes there. and. Um, Things worked out and the kids fought hard and then I thought they, they just got better and better as that match went on and um, a little disappointed we you know we had Purdue on the ropes down uh, 02 and again had some good comebacks and fought hard and played some good defense um, just couldn't sustain the level that we needed to mostly offensively and made too many errors and gave Purdue some opportunities and ended up losing that one in five but I still like the way we defended and, and the way we competed. I thought the kids played hard and they defended hard. Um, just yeah, it just came down to the execution, which was where we still need to, we need to keep getting better. I do think we're moving in the right direction, but it isn't where it needs to be to beat the top teams in our conference right now. Well, talking about Indiana a little bit, you got a, a bright spot bringing in a senior setter, Alexis Balunas. You know, she did well. Talk about her effort on the court and how well the team fed off of her in that match. Yeah, I mean, I think we were struggling. The, the, the vibe was interesting on the floor, and um, it wasn't it wasn't flowing for some reason. And you know, um, Jordan wasn't connecting with hitters, so we, we we were down big. And I thought we'd just try it and see. And Lex came in and gave us a really good spark. You know, she's a fun kid to play with, and she brings a lot of energy, and she has a lot of experience. And it's a luxury to have a player like that in the you know on the back, and or that's on, on the bench. And um, you know, she did the exact same thing against Purdue. She came in, and we were down, and the vibe wasn't where we needed to be. And uh, I thought she, she changed the whole thing and got it going. You know, that she um, setting wise, she was kind of in and out. I thought against Purdue, but uh, emotionally, she kept us at a good arousal level, and we compete and kept us competing at a high level, which was fun to see. Well, you guys are now back in Huff Hall this week. You're going to be competing against Michigan State, who's six and four in the Big Ten, and then you also have Michigan coming in, who's five and five. Yeah. Just talk about you know what you got, want the team to really focus on this week. You know, you had some energy over this weekend. You said yeah. you, you you have some things moving forward with you guys. So just what you want to see from them overall. I mean, we, we just need to reduce our errors. If we defend the way we did and then reduce our errors, I think we'll be in better shape. And um, if we compete the way we did, and I mean, we'll be fine. We just. We just uh, offensively, we have work to be done, and it's a lot about just hitting balls out of bounds. We got to hit the ball on the court, and if we do that, I think we'll be I think we'll be in great shape. I mean, get in front of our crowd, it gives us a boost, and um, I think I think that the team feels like they're moving in a good direction. Even though we lost to, per, to Purdue, and I think confidence is something we talked about before. We're struggling with a little bit, but um, I think that's starting to come around as well because they start to believe that they can actually do the things we've been talking to them about. Well, thanks, Coach, and good luck this weekend. And for more Illini sports coverage, visit FightingIllini.com.